Welcome to Fit for a Feast. My name is Sloan. And my name is Katrina. And today here on Fit for a Feast, we are making one of our favorite cookies. They're good for all year round, but we're, we like making them at Christmas. You can put them in decorated tins. Turn the oven on at 375 to preheat. The ingredients you'll need to make these yummy cookies is flour, vanilla, baking powder, baking soda, eggs, oats, butter, brown and white sugar, and brown and white chocolate chips. Also, if there's, if you're nut free, you don't have to put these in, but if you like nuts, then you can put nuts in, like we're gonna use pecans. So it's easier if you have a food processor. We're gonna use five cups of oats and then we're going to grind them up. And now I'm going to put it on high. When it's done, it should look like a fine powder. So I'm going to take the oatmeal off and put it in a big bowl. Now we're going to put in the butter, which we put into pieces. And then we put two cups of white sugar. And now put in two cups of brown sugar. Now blend until smooth. You may need to scrape at the sides, and this is here if you have soft butter. Now we're going to put vanilla and eggs in with the butter and the sugar mix. And then the eggs. Once you've finished processing it, put that, pour that mix into the bowl. Next, we're going to add the flour to the oatmeal sugar mix. Then we need to add the baking soda and the baking powder. I wash my hands really well, so now I'm going to mix with them. I'm going to measure out three cups of chocolate chips. As Katrina is mixing, I'm going to put in the chocolate chips. <laughs> and now I'm going to add the whole bag of white chocolate chips. <laughs> if you're using nuts, break them up into pieces if you need to. And now we're going to add the nuts. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. So now take your uh, cookie dough and roll it into a ball about an inch and a half diameter. depending on how soft or crispy you want them. We've taken them out. They should look like this, golden brown. Once they're cooled down, you can either put them on like a party tray or in a decorative tin for like schooling gifts. Now it's the best part when the chefs get to eat them. See you later on Fit for a Feast. Bye.